Hello everybody, this is Aviation Blue Tech coming to you with another video. Uh, today's video is going to be a continuation of my uh, JFK uh, construction update. I uh, just want to let you know what, where, uh, what I've done so far. As you can see on, uh, on, the, on the JetBlue terminal, I, uh, I moved it over. Uh, so I showed you guys last time. Um, it used to be on this side over here so I moved it 90 degrees to the front I uh, think it looks better that way now uh, also I added some uh, hard stands I added uh, far, five hard stands on uh, on the left side um, and basically I added the, the Gemini terminal I moved it from uh, it used to be in the middle between the JetBlue and the, the British Airways terminal over there. So I moved it to the back. So um, basically those uh, 11 gates in the back there is going to be uh, uh, JetBlue also. So that would give us uh, 29 gates, which is uh, what they have at JFK realistically. So uh, in the back, uh, most likely uh, for the 11 gates, it's going to be uh, Terminal 1's uh, operation, which is uh, Lufthansa, Air France, uh, Korean Airlines, and uh, Alitalia. And uh, basically all the other airlines that are that occupy that terminal. So uh, that's pretty much uh, completed. Just need to add the gates and stuff. So pretty much uh, this side is uh, pretty much uh, done. Uh, so... Um, as we go over to uh, Terminal Seven, which is a British Airways uh, terminal, well, I just I just parked those airplanes to move them while I kept on uh, working on the other side. So basically, uh, that I basically glued that together, uh, both terminals there and the taxiway, so kind of flows more fluently. Uh, in the back there is going to probably uh, I might add another Gemini terminal. Uh, Give me another 22 gates back there. Um, this side, basically everything uh, looks the the same. So um, on this side is uh, is going to be probably uh, still debating. I don't know if it's going to be uh, eight gates for Delta or, or Terminal Four uh, for the uh, eight gate A side A Conquers. I'm still debating on that. Uh, so basically, on on the on uh, Delta's terminal here, it's uh, basically what I did. I added uh, the other wing there, so it gives me another ten gates. Uh, so I just got to finish uh, the taxiways there and um, uh, put the gates and all that. So pretty much uh, coming along. Uh, now I'm gonna show you uh, the upstairs. Uh, um, on the where well, I used to have the the runway, so uh, um, let's check that out. Okay, so as you can see on uh, on this uh, this side of the terminal, um, I'm pretty much uh, completed on this. Uh, I have two Gemini uh, uh, terminals there. Uh, basically, uh, one is uh, it's gonna be American Airlines uh, terminal. Uh, in JFK, they have about, if I believe it's 26 gates and uh, eight regional uh, jets. So probably gonna have to eat into the other uh, terminal. Right now, I just have these these uh, airplanes parked here because on the construction that I'm doing downstairs. So uh, so basically, these two, one and a half of these, they're probably gonna be American. The other, I'm not sure yet which uh, which airlines I'm gonna move up here. So. Uh, just basically it's all set up uh, the gates are all done I just got to put the light posts on the, on this side um, so uh, the cargo area is pretty much uh, completed again I just parked these aircrafts there just uh, uh, obviously they're not cargo uh, airlines there those are mostly from uh, terminal 4 terminal 1 uh, but those are the cargo uh, terminal spots uh, I believe I have eight of them um, and I have all the GSC there as you can see uh, and gates 
uh, that I got it uh, put together uh, on the on the board so that's pretty much like I said it came out pretty nice uh, uh, kind of like it is all glued down all secure looks pretty nice and then uh, the runway uh, there's pretty much a uh, you know I like the way it came out uh, looks much better this way so uh, uh, in all I'm probably gonna have 150 gates which is more than I need but uh, I could use them for uh, other other airports that I plan to do in the future uh, also when I'm up here I'm gonna show you guys on this table here I will be uh, using this uh, for narrow body uh, uh, kind of uh, gates um, will probably be about 22 gates on this side so I'll be working on that so that's uh, basically it just wanted to uh, show you guys uh, what I've been working on so can't wait to get this done I want to get back and doing you guys the give you guys the updates for JFK terminal like I said I stopped at the I think it's a 2 p.m. hour so uh, kind of halfway there um, uh, so that's about it uh, let's see if I probably uh, get a couple of new models uh, that I received last week uh, kind of mix on them uh, received the Spirit Airlines uh, Aero Classic and, a, and um, I think it was um, uh, it was another uh, Neo there was a couple of Neo aircraft that I received from Aero Classics uh, uh, I think it was Viva Colombia, I think it was, or Viva Mexico, I'm not sure which airline it was, but uh, kind of makes on them, the the engines are uh, too small uh, for Neo, uh, kind of doesn't look like a Neo aircraft to me, but um, you know, what are you going to do? So I'll probably try to do a, a, a review on those uh, aircraft, so, uh, and um I'm expecting hopefully the Gemini uh, arrivals to come uh, next week. So, uh, but anyway, that was uh, that was uh, a review. Uh, well, not a review, but basically an update on the uh, construction on the uh, JFK terminal uh, airports. Uh, so, anyway, so uh, on to uh, next time. Um, uh, take care, guys.